Yo, what is up, you guys? Hope y'all been partying like every day's your birthday, man. We got a video a number a story for today, man. So make sure y'all like it, subscribe, come join the B-Day gang, man. We got the 10 most aggressive animals in the world. It's pretty much a follow-up from yesterday, man. A lot of these are going to be these zoo animals. And you know what I'm saying, y'all? I, I, I know I showed y'all yesterday the zoo animals attacking. And now I want to show y'all why you have to be afraid of them, man. So... You know what I'm saying? Y'all be careful if you go to the Amazon. You won't catch me there, but if you go, you know, make sure y'all watch this video. So, if yo, like and subscribe, and let's get right into it. And I just ended my recording, so how about now we get into it? Do you think animals are afraid of people? Well, it often goes both ways. It's that gorilla from yesterday! As fluffy as some of them may be, some animals can become extremely vicious if you get on their bad side. This doesn't mean they're completely unaware. What just happened? But in some cases, you'll want to admire these animals from a safe distance. So, tread carefully, because today, we're counting down... Bro, what is that little thingy, y'all? ...most aggressive animals in the world. Damn! 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 Can you imagine getting punched by one of those? Number 10, Hippos. Shout out Jumanji, man. I didn't know this until I watched Jumanji. The and tumbly nature of these animals fool you. Well, cute to look at, getting too close to a hippo might just be the last thing you do. Look at their jaws, y'all. Than any other mammal and are even known to attack crocodiles. Even larger Dang, they just ganged that. They just ganged that crocodile. Agitated or confused. But hippos are very territorial and will attack without any provocation. Whether you're up against a male hippo defending his territory or a female hippo protecting her calf, you're dealing with a 3,300 pound beast. This makes them very capable of capsizing and destroying entire boats filled with people. Oh, hell no, nah, bro. If I'm in the water and a hippo flips that shit, bro, y'all will see me turn into Michael Ma freaking Phelps, bro. I'll be swimming so fast. I might be flying on top of the water. I'll look like a jet boat. Cute as they may seem, approach these majestic creatures with caution. Number nine, black rhino. While African rhinos are fighting against extinction to survive, it's still important to stay on your guard if you get to see one in the wild. Yeah, man, those things. As peaceful as they look. Bro, well, I mean, though, where are you going to be at and you just going to see a rhino? And if you are, what are you doing there? Go home. Go to freak home. What are you doing? Rhinos can have a bit of a temper, and when provoked, their reactions can be unpredictable. The main reason behind their aggressiveness is their rather poor eyesight. They easily get confused and attack anything they may perceive as a threat. Dang, man. I didn't know they can't see. Hey, it's information. Yo, it's just like school, man. It's informational video for y'all to learn. And they'll charge with full force to kill or injure anything they deem to be dangerous or annoying. Never get in between a mother and her baby or anywhere near an older male. Because as fascinating as they may be, you do not want to be on the receiving end of one of those horns. Oh my gosh, can you imagine the- that was impale you, you're dead. Eight, oh, this is that little thingy thingy, man. The honey badger is the only animal on this list that's not a significant threat to humans. But nevertheless, it deserves to be here. Oh, he looks kind of cute, man. The honey badger is well known for its aggression. Damn, he's fighting a lion. The opponent far larger than itself, including lions. Whether going up against a cobra or a cape buffalo, they are the ultimate brawlers, and if cornered, they will fight to the death. Damn, yo, that bit is attacking a cheetah. They are no joke. That thing is not cute and cuddly. Their thick skin makes them resilient to most attacks, such as bee stings, porcupine quills, and animal bites. Even deadly snake venom would merely put a hunt. Damn, yo, that snake literally just went zomp right inside of his mouth. He badgered to sleep for a while, 
only to wake up with a bit of a hangover and get on with his day. So, if you wouldn't mess with a snake or a lion, you should definitely steer clear of the honey badger. No sir, you will not see me with that. Number 7. Cape Buffalo Far from your average dairy cow, uh -huh. this large African uh -huh. animal has <laughs> Whoa. That boy look a little crusty, bro. That boy needs some lotion. Reason. The African Cape Buffalo will actively stalk and attack the hunter who wounded it. Literally giving him a taste of his own medicine. Damn! He flipped the shit out that thing. Oh my god. But that boy just came over and was like, uh, bye-bye. Literally giving him a taste of his own medicine. Yeet. Each year it kills more humans in Africa than any other creature. When disturbed, a Cape Buffalo could turn aggressive against anything. Even a large predator like lions. A matured Cape Buffalo Aww. stands six feet in height and weighs Let close that boy to the The most noticeable feature and primary weapon of Cape Buffaloes are their large, thick horns. When a member of the herd or a calf is being disturbed, they would charge with their massive horns. Attacks from such a large could result in severe injuries or even death. Man, y'all, this... I mean, yeah, like, if they have a horn like that, baboons? Baboons are... Y'all, y'all y'all really need to watch this shit, bro. I did not know baboons are, are on this list. Baboons aren't exactly the most peaceful monkeys on the planet. With their bad attitudes and razor-sharp canines, they're some of the most aggressive animals you'll ever encounter. According to specialist Robert Sapolsky, a baboon troop is the textbook example of a highly aggressive, male-dominated, hierarchical society. And they're constantly duking it out with each other. Hey, While there are no got the fight clubs. Baboons attacking people. The last thing you want to do is smile at one. Male baboons may view this action as a sign of aggression and can really? charge you. Sometimes Damn, he's swatting them all with sticks. Off a few inches away. Baboons have also been known to open car doors on safari and ransack the vehicles for food. Hell no, nah. my windows will be up and locked. Defend what they've taken. Dang, man, we got master, master Shifu right here, bro. We got the master Shifu of baboons right here. That boy got the whole, you know, cloak and everything, y'all. So does this dude, but this dude look like straight master Shifu. What they've taken. Number five, black mamba. I know that's a killer. While most venomous snakes tend to flee or hide. The black mamba has been known to be more unpredictable. Not only can its venom kill a human in as little as seven hours, but it's also very fast. Having been recorded at speeds of 6.8 miles per hour. 6.8? That doesn't seem that fast. 6.8? That don't seem that fast. Can we? How fast can humans run, man? I feel like I could do 6.8 miles per hour. Although it's not the most venomous snake, its propensity for aggression still makes it one of the I promise you if that thing's behind me, I'll outrun the shit out of it. <laughs> I can put money on that. On the planet. I promise you it won't be catching me. When threatened, it can raise its head well off the ground and throw as much as 40% of its body upwards. Enabling it to strike a human's chest. Despite the reputation for aggression and death, they are not the deadly snake in Africa. That title goes to the oscillated Carper Viper. Even so, it's easy to see why you wouldn't want to cross a black mamba. Man, I don't want to cross any. Number four. What in the friggity frick is that? A cassowary? Yo, what is that? There's no way that's a real animal, man. What? The cassowary looks like a one big prehistoric turkey and has a hell of an attitude. Adults can grow to be nearly seven feet tall. What? And weigh up to 170 pounds. While their size is second only to ostriches, cassowary attacks are known to be far deadlier. When provoked, 
they become extremely aggressive and attack viciously, using their powerful legs and sharp claws as primary weapons. With one blow using these claws, they can even break the bones of a human. Ooh, bro, that's when you just beak! I'm sorry, bro. I, you should never hit an animal, but if a bird jumps out at me like that, I'm gonna just but one time to the face. I have to. That dude right there needs it. Look, he got this whole floor, bro. That's when you just need a beak. You know what I'm saying? Few birds convey a don't mess with me vibe. Oh, shit, boy, you possible. better go. Just look at this picture of a scientist holding the claw of a male southern cassowary. Just in case you still needed convincing that birds are living dinosaurs amongst us. Number three, polar bear. I mean, of course, this has to be on the list. If you were out on the ice and see a polar bear, it's too late. He's probably been stalking you for hours. Really? The largest meat eater living on land. Polar bears are extremely protective of their cubs and attack viciously when there is a perceived threat. They are the largest bears on Hell Earth. no. With males growing up to weigh around 700 kilograms. With all that force, They're kind of cute polar though. Bear can cut off a human head with a swipe of its paw. While they don't seek out confrontations, if they're really hungry or feel threatened, they'll hunt, kill, and eat. Oh my gosh, they took out a whale? As they say about bears, if it's black, attack. If it's brown, stay down. If it's white, good night. Wait, that's a thing? Hold on, y'all. I need to remember this. Hey, every one of y'all need to remember this, man. It's important information. If it's black, attack. If it's black, attack. If it's brown, stay down. If it's brown, stay down. If it's, brown, stay down. If it's white, Good night. You're dead. So if it's white, you're dead. You, you dead as hell. Tosa Inu dog. A dog? The Tosa Inu dog is a Japanese mastiff. Right that don't look too bad. Dog fighting machine. It should be no surprise then that animal aggression is a serious issue. Tosas are fearless protectors of the people they love. That's kind of nice. If they perceive something as a threat, they will attack it without hesitation. That, that could be a problem. Predatory behavior, actively hunting cats, small dogs, and any animal that runs. Damn, he's a straight karate he's chop that man in the neck. He's generally not supposed to be aggressive towards people. But the size and athleticism of this breed make them one huge responsibility. There are very few people who can and should want to own a Tosa. As they need to be kept under control at all times. Perhaps if you want a dog to participate in the sport of weight pulling, seeing as Tosas can pull more than 3,000 pounds, how many people can handle a dog? What? There's no way. That has to be wrong. How are you supposed to walk a dog that can carry three schmucking thousand pounds, bruh? There's no way you can walk that. That thing sees a squirrel, you're telling me that it could, it could pull an elephant? I don't know about that. I don't know about that. I need to fact check that. Pounds. The answer is no one. This breed cannot be outmuscled. Before we reveal number one, be sure to check out other amazing videos on our channel. Yes, sir. Give Make sure y'all like check them out. This video so far. Also, tell us in the comments which one of these is most beautiful according to you. Number one. <laughs> Master Splinter is the most dangerous animal in the world? Tasmanian Devil. This fierce creature is found only in the Australian island state. Is he me mugging me? Of Tasmania. They earn the name Devil for being prone and very quick to become aggressive. They display a frightening appearance by showing their teeth and screeching very loudly. An unprovoked Tasmanian Devil won't attack humans. But this fearless creature won't hesitate to take a bold move to defend. I don't think out of everything on the list, you telling me that's the thing I should be the most afraid of? Defend himself. Don't be fooled by their size, as Tasmanian Devils has the most powerful bite relative to body size of any living mammalian carnivore. Scary pose. That sounds kind of scary. The Tasmanian Devil actually uses one other weapon to avoid initial confrontation. 
When threatened, they produce a foul smell in an attempt to get rid of the danger. With all those devilish features combined, it's no surprise... Oh my gosh, they're going to town on that! ...how they got the name. Dang, y'all, what's happening here? We got a freaking elephant getting stabbed in a... A tiger killing a kid? What the heck? Hey, man, I hope you guys enjoyed that video, man. Make sure y'all like and subscribe, y'all. We got some more for y'all today. We gonna have no more video for y'all. And, uh, yeah. You gonna have, you know, daily content. Why would you not want to join somebody who puts, you know, four to five videos a day? You never have to worry about not having videos to watch. You know what I'm saying? No? All right, that's fine, too. So, y'all have a great day, man. Y'all be easy and deuces.